It's Chelsea and Chris and Carter. Say hi, Carter. Hi, YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. Look, look at the light. Hi, YouTube. She doesn't care. She almost not. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so today is the 18th. We're on time. It's a six month oh, update. Oh. I almost said bump day. Oh my God. No, I don't want to go back there. <laughs> I do. It's fun. <laughs> it's our six month update. Um, we hope that you guys had a beautiful holiday season. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. Um, I'm not one for resolutions, but I have to say that I had a lot of 2016 goals when it comes to this channel. Yes, she did. So. Look out. <laughs> <laughs> um, thank you to the new subbies. Uh, we've been seeing that increase as well. Um, I don't know. We just are so grateful that you guys continue to follow us and that we, you know, are keep getting new followers as well, um, entering into our journey. We just hope you enjoy. And we just love to, you know, meet you guys and network with you guys. And it's just awesome how big this community is really getting. Yeah, really. I didn't expect anybody to watch these no. videos. It was more for, you know, us to look back on. Uh, I'm glad that. Well, our videos personally, but I mean the community as a whole. Oh, like yeah, yeah, Everybody yeah. that we've been able to, the you know, yeah. speak to and reach through this channel. It's like, it, it amazes me. Um, but anyway, um, we have, this is our first time, so bear with us. We got a new camera. <laughs> <laughs> so the quality should be much better. This Which was, was my goal. Yes, this was a joint Christmas present to each other. Um, Along with our tattoos. Yeah, that and our tattoos. We wanted to, we, we have, like we really don't want for, or need for, for much. much. So <clears throat> we wanted to recreate what we did our first Christmas. So we got tattoos together. I believe I posted a picture of that. If I didn't, I will link it. Um, or I will post it. That brings me into I did I have been getting quite a few um, Facebook messages first and foremost before we jump into this update um, on my personal page and I haven't been ignoring you I promise um, if I haven't already sent you an invite I will after I'm done recording this um, but we decide we, we have to for job related purposes um, and privacy purposes as well we have to keep our YouTube and our personal separate so I did create today a new Facebook um, under the, our same domain name. It's LBC Cardio Five. Right, and I'll link it below or link it in our bio. And again, if I haven't gotten to sending you the request, I will. Trust me, I'm not ignoring you. I'm gonna, you know, send it from that page, just not well, my personal. I don't even have Facebook, so I haven't gotten any requests. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> uh, um, well. The other thing that is new as well, um, we have been getting requests for, um, a PO you know, box. for a PO box, um, people wanting to send us things and we're not, I was reluctant to do it because I don't want to feel like you guys are obligated to send us anything. It's definitely not for that purpose. Um, but I, we like to be able to send things out to other people too, but the privacy police here does not like me giving out our, cause we, we have a, a person like a residence a, a home so you can find if i give you a return address you know exactly where we live in so that's for anybody <laughs> stranger danger anyway so okay so we have a p.o box too <laughs> i will link it below i remember that it's p.o box 229 but i don't remember the rest of it um by heart yet so i will link it below we did get that as well again i told you i'm working on them 2016 goals girls <laughs> so <laughs> look out we will be doing much better um, when it comes to being more serious about the channel and the direction that it's going to be going in. So with that said, thank you again to all the subbies that have been with us um, from Jump and to the new ones that are still coming on. We greatly appreciate you. We love you all. Absolutely. We love to, you know, just to communicate with you guys and just to continue, you know, broadening our, um, I guess, network. What do you, what do you yeah. call it? Cause we had so much fun. I'm sorry she didn't want to do it, but I have to give a <laughs> shout out to Miss Katrina and Tiff. We were able to meet one of our subscribers, and we had so much fun. It was yeah. such a good. It was a good time. We haven't had a date night or just um, any time without the baby, the baby or children, all three of them for that yeah. matter. So yeah. thank you for that invite. We definitely enjoyed um, hanging out with you guys, and we can't wait to do it again. Yeah, um, the other day when I went to go get my hair cut, I felt like it was a night at the club. <laughs> that, was only <laughs> that was the only one to get my hair cut at Home Depot, and I felt so free. That was kind of sad. I was blasting my music. I was doing yeah, something. It's, it's, it's bad. bad. But it's, bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
It's all right. We it's got some bad. turn up. We got some things to be turning up in the future. Yeah, so we'll take you along with us with that. Going to Walmart. It's sad. It's anyway. okay. It's good. It's sad good. <laughs> That's enough update for the two of us. Now on to the six month update. I cannot believe this baby is six months already. Yeah. Half a year old. It's going by way so too fast. fast. I know I keep saying it over and over again. I sound like a broken record, but I can't. I can't believe how fast this is going with her. Um, she had her six month checkup. Um, this this past week, it was on the 14th, so it was a few days ago. She is coming in at 79 percentile for her weight and 77 percentile for her height. So she is now 17 pounds and 11 ounces. My big Luda. Right, my big girl. You my big girl. You did the smile. <laughs> That's my big girl. And uh, 26 and a half inches tall. So almost as tall as me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Any, anyway. Um, yeah, so she's definitely getting up in size. Um, she's still in the six to nine months when it comes to Carter. We just had to do a complete overall of her nursery and get rid of everything that was under six months. Yeah, because she was busting out. We were squeezing her into newborns when she was a newborn, though, so we knew. Yeah, it was going to But it was like right. five large, five But there was so much stuff clothes. that I couldn't even, like, put there, her in. There was a whole drawer I missed of onesies. That's because you don't listen. Whatever. But what'd you say? I wasn't listening. Yeah, you wasn't listening to what I was telling <laughs> you, what's in each drawer. I missed an entire drawer of the cutest onesies, and it was a missed opportunity. So, hey, okay, is anybody in need of oh, zero yeah. to, uh, what is it, zero six. to three? No, because we have the six months. No, well, yeah. Okay, zero, zero to three, three. months. <laughs> Let me know. Let I can know. send now since I have a few. That's months. true. <laughs> anyway, okay. So next, I'm getting off topic. Sorry. Um, so, yeah, she's in the six to nine months still. However, with the mm-hmm. different um, brands, she's in between nine to 12 months. Like when it comes to, I don't think it's Gerber. It's another brand that she has. Like First Expressions, I, I forgot what it is. But she, in some of her clothes, she's even in the nine to 12 months. And I bought her a whole bunch of fleece sleepers because they have like a huge sale, but they only had the 18 months. So, you know, I figured she can grow into it. And we put it on her and it really did. Why are you giving it her? I need that. Oh, she wanted it. That's what you were doing. <laughs> no. Sorry. We really needed them <laughs> and they looked like they would fit her and they actually did like she filled them out she has a few obviously she has like um you know a few more inches to grow into them but she filled the 18 months out like pretty well but that was like walmart brown but still like that's the main thing is her months. feet she has really big feet so anything with feet she needs a bigger size because she was a size oh, okay, you do oh, it? okay. No. Uh, she was a size two when she was like born yeah, pretty much. So she couldn't wear her baby slippers. She wore those for what, three days? If that. If that, yeah. Yeah, so it's getting crazy. She still is in size threes, though, but that's also because we completely skipped size twos. We needed to. She had her. So she's still in. She had her wearing the pamper looking like a thong. It was ridiculous. No, I do not. So she did. They fit her snugly. Those pampers were so tight. It was crazy. It's like, no. We have to go up with a thong, really? It was kind of tight. So she's still in size three diapers, y'all. Yeah, she's about um, to go to <laughs> At the appointment, uh, the doctor was very pleased and surprised with her strength and her ability to sit up. She's been doing great skills. with it. Um, yes, and we did express to her the problems that she's, she's still having the problems with her bowel movements. Um, it's, she has these blood curdling screams that you know, you know when she's going, because it just hurts her so bad. She bleeds and everything down there. It's just so, it's so heartbreaking to watch. Um, but at least when it's when it's done, like she's back to the happy baby, yeah. she's bouncing around and smiling and everything. So at least it does pass. Uh, but it's still hard to watch her go through that. So the doctor did say, um, oh, that's the other thing too. She doesn't really eat that much of the first um, first stage foods. Up until today, she didn't eat any at all. Not really. Except yeah, for she kind of like she kind of like the prunes. No, but the rice bottles is what is helping her like. Um, <laughs> Binding hard enough yeah, yeah. yeah. Here. so we're trying to we only do the rice bottles right, um right. when she goes down to sleep she'll do one rice bottle because we're limiting it so we could try to you know loosen her bowel movements up um but today you're not even letting me finish your statement go ahead what no. go ahead oh, you want to talk so no. bad go ahead no no i see him be eye candy it's fine okay anyway 
since she wasn't eating at the time of the visit, the doctor did recommend that we get her some ripe water, which we have not gotten yet, but we will get that. And um, they said that we can try just regular yogurt. She said maybe it was the texture that she didn't like or something like that. So um, we will be trying that. However, now you can say what you were saying. She was able to eat the prunes and enjoyed it thoroughly today. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, go I don't know what you were going to say. Go ahead. She ate the prunes. That's it? That's it. That's all I need to say. That was too much. Um, yeah. So with the foods, <laughs> we're still going to continue to introduce them to her. Um, we have to do them. I'm sure you guys know that I already have babies that are eating the foods. We have to give her the same thing three days in a row to make sure that she doesn't have any reactions to it and then move on to the next flavor. So we will be um, introducing more to her. And another interesting thing that the doctor said that I did not know was um, the other foods that we got her to try that she wasn't really feeling. Um, we just thought that that was a, you know, that's a wash. Okay, forget about those. But the doctor said that it takes a baby up to 10 times to try a specific flavored food before they can determine whether or not they really like it or not. So that was good to know and we'll know to keep trying. I'm not allowed to speak now. You can speak, okay. just don't interrupt me. Go ahead. Oh, my apologies. Go ahead. Calm down. Oh my God. You want me to abuse you on camera. Wow. <laughs> I want to smack you right now. Because <laughs> you get me off track. You know I'm not 100% right now. Anyway, okay. So that's it for the, um, for the visit, basically. Her development, though, she is squealing. She recognizes her name when you call her. You know, call her the baby. She'll turn around for you. Um, the cutest thing, she shakes her head no. Um, what was the thing that you said that she... If oh, I, you want to go to bed? If I'm like, are you tired? You want to take a nap? And she goes, no. no. She's reaching for everything. Yes. And she has to get into everything. As you can see, she's squirming and this is all day. She loves her, her jumper. Jumper. That's loves it. the jumper. She goes hard in that. And she doesn't need any assistance anymore because we used to have like a little yeah. um, platform for her to jump off of. So now her toes reach and she, those big those toes, hands. she goes, it's crazy. <laughs> Um, a big thing that's popular in this house for her today is the, not today, just in general, is uh, the pickup game. She loves to throw her toys so you can pick them up and she can throw them right down again. I don't miss that game, but she seems to like it. Um, she is, uh, she loves to fly. She loves it if you like, you know, like hold her up. Oh, well, I think we, yeah, that was a good video. Mm -hmm. I can attach a little snippet of that, her little flying baby. Um, she loves it. Uh, she crawled for the first time. I documented the date because I wanted to remember it. On the 11th, she did her first crawl. It wasn't the traditional, but in her own way, she was crawling. She's inchworm. She, inchworm backwards, backwards, inchworm. Yeah, backwards That's what she inchworm. does. She went backwards across the whole length of our living room. It was so adorable to watch her do that. We were so surprised and we were cheering her on and she was so surprised at herself. She was like, I'm on the go now. Right, boo-boo? Yeah. yeah. She caresses oh, your no. face. <laughs> she loves Chelsea's hair. hair. See? And it hurts sometimes. Her nice yeah, it's so cute. She twirls her little curl. Yeah. She's sitting up in the tub. Did you talk about that? No, I didn't. Much? Oh, yeah, she sits up unassisted. Yeah, so um, she sits up in the tub. For her, and I sit her down on the floor, and we'll play patty cake, and she loves it. Um, she still has to, like, she'll hold her arms up just to stabilize herself, but for the most part, she's she's good sitting up already. And she hates laying down now. Like, even... Well, because she's able to yeah, discover more things yeah. when she's up and on so the So the bumper chair... Even in the bouncer, she sits up. Yeah, she can she roll her way out of, uh, out of her, um, like the stationary bouncer. Yeah. yeah. It should be mobile be. soon. I'm kind of looking forward to it, but then I'm not because I'm like, damn, we're not really that baby proof. Yeah. We got to get on that. that. <laughs> yeah, we got to get on that sooner than later. Um, another thing. No, I'm not going to do that. Oh, that's cute. Get like a little cute little monkey one. No, I'm not no. going to do that. Oh, if you want to do it, back. I'm not going to go back in the mall. Okay. She's going to stay right next to my side. Lost children at Just saying. I've never lost my children. I'm just saying. Okay. And also, oh, a few days ago, me. she um, was able to, for the first time, put her foot in her mouth and actually suck on her toes. <laughs> oh, you got your boo -boo. Yeah, we got to cut this, cut this short. Well, basically, I think that's it for the update, actually. <laughs> Uh -oh. Okay, yeah. right on time because she's getting fussy. Yeah. She's tired. Yeah. You want your monkey? You're not 
not gonna show a smile. You're not gonna show happy baby to the YouTubers. No. Alright, she's saying night night. Alright. <laughs> That's it, because she's starting to get fuzzy. So we right, hope guys, you enjoyed we'll this next month time. update. We will see you next time. We have a lot in store. Um, so stick with us, alright? Talk to you later. Love you. Bye. Bye. -bye.